Hello, my dear students. I welcome you all to the Science Nest YouTube channel. Uh, today, in this video, I'm going to explain you the second term test paper, science paper of Northwestern Province 2019. First of all, we will see about the MCQs. Underline the diagram which shows the fungi. Here, the first one uh, is the muca. Muca is a type of fungi. The second one shows the bacteria. Third picture shows you the virus. And the fourth one, chlamydomonas. So the answer is answer number one. Nuca is a type of fungi. The second question, which type of vertebrates can be considered as the first vertebrates that entered into terrestrial environment? Answer number three, amphibians. But the amphibians need water to complete their lifestyle, life cycle. Third one, the two common eye diseases that can be identified are cataract and glaucoma. Answer number two. Growth of the stem of a tree upward is growth of the stem of a tree upward. Uh, that growth movement is uh, answer number one, negative geotrophic movement. That means uh, this growth is against the gravity, against the gravity. That is why we select it as negative geotrophic movement. Fifth one, given below is an occasion of exerting a force on a rectangular wood block. What is the point of application of the force? Here the answer number four, D is the point of application of the force. And Point of application of a force is the point on which the force is acting on the object. The point D is the answer. Question number six. Which, on, which one of the following is the correct observation obtained by electrolyzing acidulated water? When electrolysis of acidulated water in this process uh, from the positive electrode, Oxygen is releasing and from the negative electrode, hydrogen is releasing. So answer number one, evolving gas bubbles at the two electrodes is the answer. Seventh one, what is the artificial growth substance that can be used to get mango fruits in off seasons? Here the answer number one, indole acetic acid can be seen, can be used to do this one. Eighth one, the answer which includes only natural ecosystems. In the first one, settlements are not natural, they are artificial. In the second one, agricultural lands are artificial. In third one, all are natural ecosystems. But the fourth one, industrial ecosystem is artificial ecosystem. So here the answer is answer number three. Ninth one, for the movement of animals, they use both muscles and bones. Answer number four. Tenth one, what is the living fossil that was discovered in the sea near South Africa in 1938, which was believed to the extinct about 70 million years ago? Answer number two, Koilankat is the answer. Koilankat. Eleventh one, a concrete cube which weighs of 7,000 Newton is placed on the floor. Uh, it touches 14 cubic me uh, square meters area of the floor. What is the pressure exerted by the concrete tube? Yeah, you should know what is the method of finding the pressure. P equal F divided by A. This is the method of finding the pressure. Then F should be in the upper part and the area should be in the lower part. So answer number one, which one is not a disease of viral infection? Uh, here, the answer number three, malaria is a protozoa disease, not a virus disease. Question number 13, uh, which component of the blood shows a low value or rapid decline more than normal value when examining a blood report of a dengue patient? Answer number one. Platelets are decreasing if the person is suffering from dengue. 14. This diagram shows a setup which can be used to plate copper on an iron grid. 
plate means applying copper on iron ring, but should be used for X electrode. Here, when electroplating, the metal rod that is going to be plate is used in the positive terminal and the object that subjected to place plate is used in the negative terminal. So a copper plate should be in the positive terminal. Copper plate and the iron ring should be in the negative terminal. Y is the iron ring and X is the copper plate. 15th question, which one of the following is not considered to get a correct reading from a hydrometer to measure the amount of water in a milk bottle? We are using a special hydrometer named as lactometer and to measure the amount of water in an alcohol bottle, we use another special hydrometer named as alcohol meter and uh, to check the amount of charging of an lead acid accumulator we use the hydrometer but in the third instance we are not using the hydrometers to measure the amount of heavy metals in a water bottle we are not using the hydrometer 16 the technology used to remove pollutants from the environment is known as bioremediation a removing organic pollutants from water b fermentation and producing of alcohol producing of biodegradable plastic. What is the correct answer with bioremediation method? Answer A and C correct. They are the instances that are using the bioremediation. To get high quality plate by the electroplating, small electric current should be used and the electrolyte should be a very dilute solution. These are the two requirements to take a high quality plate. And the C is not important. It is not a required need to have a high quality electroplating. So answer number two, A and B only are correct. 18, select the most effective method of, select the most effective method of land management. Here yeah, the answer number three, mixed crop cultivation. In the mixed crop cultivation, uh, so many varieties of crops can be taken from one land area. 19th one, select the most correct statement. The number of proton is equal to the number of electrons in a neutral atom. Yes, it is correct. That is the correct answer. Others are incorrect. Which one of the following is incorrect? Here, the answer is answer number uh, four, human blood contains blood corpuscles than the blood plasma. It is wrong. The reason is uh, in the human blood, there are 55% of blood plasma and 45% of blood corpuscles or blood cells. And the other sentences are correct. Uh, the recipient who are rhesus positive can receive both rhesus positive and rhesus negative blood but rhesus negative recipients can receive rhesus negative blood only and the right atrium of the heart get deoxygenated blood through inferior vena cava and superior vena cava let's start the part two of the question paper first question organisms that cannot be observed through naked eye are considered as the microorganisms. They show a wider distribution in the environment and even can be lived in extreme environments. They have beneficial and disadvantageous effect on humans and animals. A, question number, Roman number one, write down the name of a group of microorganisms that you know. You should write down only one name here. I'll put here, Bacteria. Next one, what is the group of microorganisms which shows both living and non-living characteristics? Here the answer is virus. Virus shows living characteristics and non-living characteristics. Uh, in the virus, the only living characteristic is it can divide inside the living organisms. 
and the other all the other characteristics are non living write an example for extreme environment extreme environment means very hard environments we cannot live in the extreme environments uh, one example for that is glaciers glaciers deserts hot springs can be taken state a situation which uh, shows the usage of microorganisms for bio remediation there should be our remediation in the environmental conservation uh, the bio remediation here you should know what is the definition for the bio remediation that is uh, microorganisms are using uh, when removing the environmental pollutants that is the bio remediation you have to write down one situation here i put it removing organic substances removing organic substances from organic waste materials from water body that is the relevant answer removing organic waste materials from water bodies Name the pathogenic microorganism that causes tuberculosis. Tuberculosis is causing uh, by a type of bacteria. We will write down it as a bacteria. Next one, B part. Substance in transportation is carried out throughout the body through the blood circulatory system. it performs many functions and uh, eating to various obstacles that's a mistake in typing the question the proper functioning of the blood circulatory system must be maintained to sustain a healthy life what kind of name is given to the blood vessels that take blood away from the heart the answer is arteries arteries are taking the blood away from the heart the other blood vessels are veins write down the function of the blood write down transportation of substances throughout the body transportation of substances throughout the body next one what is the value between the left atria uh, what is the difference there should be difference between the left atrium and left ventricle of the heart i'm uh, sorry what is the valve what, what is the valve there should be v what is the valve between the left atrium and left ventricle of the heart answer is bicuspid valve next b part in the case of emergency giving blood from one individual to another is known as blood transfusion look at the diagram and write down the most correct word for the empty box this empty box should be recipient empty box should be recipient the person who are taking the blood from another person next what is the constituent of the blood cells that causes to decide the blood group the answer is proteins what makes blood agglutination happen blood agglutination means blood clotting blood clotting is happening because uh, blood groups are incompatible in incompatible because of the blood groups are incompatible incompatible means they are not suitable to each other
Next one. Write a situation where we can do a blood transfusion. The answer is in an operation. In an operation. Write down a good habit that helps to keep the proper and healthy blood circulatory system. Write down one healthy habit here. Avoid taking salty diets regularly. Is my answer. An erect plant pot falls down a few days later. It seems the apex turns towards and the roots turn towards the ground. What is the chemical that causes the changes in the plant apex and the root of the plants? The chemical name is. Yeah, the name of the chemical is plant hormone. Plant hormone. And the growing of the plant root towards the ground is a towards the ground is a positive positive trophic movement, and the growing of the apex upwards is a negative geotrophic negative geotrophic movement. Let's move to the question number two. A child is standing on the seashore. He is a ship at distance. He, uh, he sometimes stands on his tips, tips of toes like this. On which situation the pressure occurs most on the sand? Most on the sand. Here, uh, you know the equation for the pressure is P equal F divided by A. P equal F divided by A. If the student is in their, uh, in his source, you can see the surface area that is contacting with the surface is reduced than the previous instance. So in the B instance, the A is very low. So the pressure is very high. So the pressure is very high. That is the way of comparing the situations of the pressure. Next one, which situation on which situation the pressure occurs most on the sand? Situation B. Which factor affects the pressure in A and B directly? Directly, the factor is area, surface area. Name another factor that affects the pressure in addition to the Factor mentioned above. The other factor is the perpendicular force. Perpendicular force. Okay, let's move to the question number four. Write the relationship that is used to calculate the pressure. I have written it here. P equal. Divide by A. State the standard international unit of measuring pressure accurately. The pressure is measuring from Newton per square meters. Newton per square meters. Or we are telling it as Pascal. Given below is a rough diagram of two organs of the human body. What is the organ represented by B? Here they ask about the B organ. B organ name is human, human ear. Name the parts A, B and C. Here A is eye lens. B is optic nerve, C is cochlea. What is the function of D? Function of D. 
D means semicircular canals. The function of them is to maintain the body balance. To maintain the body balance. Question number three, the mass of unit volume in a given substance is called the density of that material. Write down the relationship that is used to calculate the density. The density equals mass divided by the volume. That is the way of finding the density. Given the international, give the international standard unit used to measure the density. Here the answer is kilograms per cubic meter. Or you can write down the symbols of that also. Draw, draw a diagram of a device that can be used to measure the density of a liquid. The uh, device is named as the hydrometer and you can draw it like this. Next one, name the element that elements that contain the combination of the formula below methane. Elements are carbon and hydrogen only. There are 11 electrons in a sodium atom. The number of protons, there should be protons, not electrons. Number of protons in the nucleus, nucleus is 12. What is the number of protons in a sodium atom? Number of protons and number of electrons are same. So answer 11. And find out the mass number. Mass number equals the sum of the electrons and some electrons and the neutrons. So answer is 23. Third one. Fill Fill in the spaces correctly. General name water. Name of the compound is water. Chemical formula should write down here. Chemical formula H2O. Next, carbon dioxide is there. So the name of the compound is carbon dioxide. Sodium chloride, the normal name is salt and the chemical formula has given here. Question number four. Following is a diagram of a setup that has been arranged by grade nine students for electrolysis activity. The solutions given below are put into the beaker at least one solution at time. One solution at time. Here you should know what is the electrolyte. Electrolytes are the liquids or solutions which can conduct electricity. From here, uh, there are two electrolytes, salt solution and copper sulfate solution. There are ions so they can conduct the electricity. So they ask, name a solution which gives a deflection of the emitter. Uh, to give a deflection in the emitter, a current should pass through it. Then there should be an electrolyte. So answer may be salt solution or copper sulfate solution. Indicate a solution that does not cause for a deflection of the emitter when put into the beaker. Distilled water. And also, kerosene oil do not show any deflection. When the circuit is connected by putting copper sulfate solution, mention an observation near the X electrode. 
x electrode is the positive electrode of this apparatus. So write down the observation at their evolution of gas bubbles. Give an observation near the y electrode. Write down the answer. Deposition of red brown color substance. Name a substance that best suit for X and Y. Carbon. Carbon or we can take platinum also because uh, they are known as inert electrodes. Uh, they does not react chemically with the electrolyte. What is the reason not to use iron as a metal material for X and Y? Because iron is reacting Iron is reacting with the electrolyte. Question number five. B part. Uh, plants and animals do movements for their, their own needs. Give an example for the movements of the plants below. Write down the examples for the Gnostic movement. Blooming of flowers with the sunrise. Here you should know what are the Gnostic movements and what are the trophic movements. Trophic movements are growth or movement that occur due to a direct influence between the direction of stimulus and direction of response. And there are some types of trophic movements, positive geotropism, negative geotropism, positive phototropism, positive hydrotropism, positive chemotropism, positive thigmotropism. And the Gnostic movements are the movements uh, Response of the direction does not depend on the direction of the stimulus. Those are the Gnostic movements. Here, Nictinastic movements, Haptonastic movements, Seismonastic movements, and Photonastic movements are there. Right, uh, one example for the trophic movements. Example for the trophic movement is roads growing towards the ground. Roads growing towards the ground. Name the organ used for the locomotion of the animals given below. Paramecians use cilia for their locom locomotion. Dolphins are using fins for their locomotion. Uh, we call them as flippers. In signal aval path. Fifth one, picture one shows a plant grown in a pot, and picture two shows it is fallen. It is fallen and grown. The reason for such growth of the plant is one of the growth substances which produces of the place X. What is the growth substance that is produced in X? The answer is oxygen. Write down two impacts on plants due to growth substances. Write down them stimulating growth, stimulating the growth, and inhibiting the growth. Next question number two.
state the uses of artificial growth substances given below. So for dichlorophenoxyacetic acid, the use of it is to use as a broad leaf we decide. As a broad leaf we decide. Indole acetic acid answer is to induce root formation of stem cutting. Stem cuttings. B part fossils provide important probes for evolution. What is meant by living fossil? Here I'll write down the definition for the living fossil. The organisms who survive even today retaining their physical properties unchanged. They are the living fossils. Give an example for a living fossil here. Lingula coelacanth can be taken. 